I'm Lynn Bowie, and this is a WJZ 13 at your desk update. A man is rescued overnight after a trench collapsed at an industrial park in northeast Baltimore. It happened at a construction site at 6600 Quad Avenue. Rescuers arrived, and three people were in that trench. Just one was trapped about 15 feet down. It's not clear if the other two men jumped in to help free the man. Around 3.30 this morning, crews used a rope to get the man out. He was taken to shock trauma with non-life-threatening injuries. Police arrest a suspect in the stabbing of a Baltimore County man during a road rage incident on the intercounty connector. 49-year-old Ronald Paul of Laurel is charged with attempted second-degree murder. Police say Paul started to pass traffic on the right shoulder when a pickup truck moved into his path, blocking him. They say Paul then got out of his car and stabbed the passenger of the truck. The victim is expected to recover. Paul is being held without bond. Tessa Hill Ashton, the head of the Baltimore branch of the NAACP, is stepping down. She told our media partner, the Baltimore Sun, her decision was based on completing key goals, including hosting the national convention this past summer. She ran the Baltimore branch of the NAACP for seven years. The group's first vice president is in line to become acting president until next year's election. The award winning Netflix series House of Cards is shooting in Baltimore County. The popular political drama normally shoots in Harford County, but yesterday they were seen filming in Putty Hill Plaza. The series stars Kevin Spacey as the scheming President Frank Underwood and Robin Wright as First Lady Claire Underwood.